morning everyone. We are on our way to our first meal of the day, which is sushi. We're gonna head there now, it's a bit far, so we're gonna get coffee after. Since we struggled finding this, I'm gonna give you a tip. This restaurant is located at exit C6. I'm excited. And I don't know if I already mentioned this, but you have to stand while eating. So, good for digestion. They have unlimited matcha here. Is that not crazy? Let's take a sip. Mm, wow, that is nice. Salmon with cheese. Oh, Salmon again. Look at this beautiful platter. Look how fatty it is. This is my favorite place so far. So after lunch, we are now heading back to Harajuku because we didn't want to stay in the area for too long. I'm gonna go and explore some coffee shops and do more shopping. Latte, just because I haven't had one yet and I've been craving it so I'm excited hopefully it's yummy it's still slightly raining but I think the first stop is going to be Stussy somehow always get something at Brandy. Mini shopping break. Stopped by this really cute cafe for some drinks. I got a craft white cola. This is something that I've been wanting to try. Whoa. I'm like actually will. I can't tell if I like it or not. I also got a canale. I think that's what these are called. It's very airy. I like this one. Craft cola is a no though. The shopping is over for the day. Maybe. We're now at the Maputo place that I showed you guys, and they actually make you order a drink, which is fine, I'm not complaining, but I have an obsession with lemon sour. So, cheers, let's see if it's better than the one last night. It's like a whole lemon. First dish, some steamed dumplings. Damn, these dumplings are juicy. Kind of blowing my mind a little bit. Guys, 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 I wish you could smell this. I like how there's a lot of green onion as well. Okay. After an amazing meal, we are now heading to what I am most excited for. We're going to... We are going... 
We are going to a head spa. We're going to uh, a sixth floor. I might not be able to show you the sink later, so I'm gonna show you the sink now. This has to be the bougiest experience I have ever been to. This room is crazy. The customer service, I don't deserve it. So I'm gonna change into the spa outfit that they prepared for me, and then we're gonna get started on the head spa. Okay, I'll see you guys once I get changed. After. These are the shampoos that I get to pick from. They're just different scents, but I'm going with the lavender one. Normally we have like um, a head spa on like once in a month. A month. Yeah. That's so nice. Yeah. I fell asleep and started snoring. Guys, look at this finished product. Like, are you kidding? It's so good. Worth every penny, and I definitely will be back. Anyways, I need to get changed now. I'll see you guys in a bit. <laughs> That's good. Morning guys, we are starting our day off with our first sightseeing location. We've been doing a lot of shopping and eating, so this is a really nice change of pace. got here could not find the restaurant it's in this really skinny building and by the time we found it now there is a huge line down the stairs hopefully we'll be second round and I think you get to eat for 45 minutes for all you can eat I'm still excited I'm hungry please let it be my turn already We're here guys, we're seated and we are ready and cooking. We got set A. I don't even know what meat it is because I tried to Google Translate it. I'm not sure what's going on. I'm on cooking duty. It looks yummy and it smells amazing, so I'm excited to finally eat. Okay, I'm gonna do a taste test. Mmm. Mmm. We ordered another set. This is set B. Mm. I like more of a black pepper salty flavor. Set A. Set B, both meat, they're sweeter. We just finished lunch and I highly recommend that place. I could not believe that it was $10 for 45 minutes of all you can eat. On the train, heading to a crepe spot. my moment. That is delicious. We just finished at the crepe spot. I like the chewiness of it. And I also really liked how the whole vibe in the place felt like I was in a Studio Ghibli movie. Now we're gonna head to the thrifting area and we're gonna see if we can find something before dinner. Look 
look how tiny. This is a real small. Wait, that's really good. Whoa, it's pretty yummy. I'm only a Tidus jacket you'll ever need in any colorway. We had to rush to dinner, but we made it because our reservation was at 5 and we got here at 5.15. The first dish is this really, really pretty tofu. That is really thick. That one was really good. Steaming, that's what I like to see. Dinner was delicious, but somehow we ended up at the biggest Uniqlo in Tokyo. I'm gonna go see what I can find, but this place is 12 floors. I am finally back at the hotel, and I have my favorite thing in my hand right now. Yes! Actually, this is my first time trying the strawberry flavor, so I am so excited, but I haven't had a Coolish this entire trip. Mmm, the original is better. Tomorrow is the last full day in Tokyo, so I will see you tomorrow morning. Starting off in the morning at this cute little coffee shop that's super close to our hotel, actually. I'm gonna taste this, this and then we have to go. That is yummy. Okay, heading out now. Taking a mini break at the Dover Street Bakery and I got recommended the carrot cake. It's a very tall cake. Whoa. I love a thick frosting. Mmm. It's very nutty. I almost wish it was more moist. So after Dover Street, we are now here in Shibuya because we actually booked a massage. And right next door is actually... Da -da -da -da! Do you see it? It's Shoto Curry. and head out. My feet, they were killing me this entire trip, but now she's revived. I'm gonna get out of here because I'm pretty sure they're like, why is that girl taking so long? <laughs> So after the massage, we weren't hungry yet because the lunch was so late at Joto Curry. We decided to come back to Shimokirazawa to do some more shopping. If you guys remember, a couple months ago, I was here with Issa and Kiana and I went into th a thrift store and 
found a beautiful Loewe bag. I went back to that store and as you saw in the previous clip, I found another one. I'm gonna do some more walking until we're tired and then we'll see where we end up. This cute little izakaya spot. It's Japanese only, so Kyle has to do some translation for us. It looks promising. It looks promising with all the people in here. First plate. Straight to the meat. First thing. I think pork belly. Mm. It's good, right? Mm. That is delicious. Mm. <laughs> that is great. On our way home now, look at this beautiful view of the Tokyo Tower. I've showered and am ready to go to bed. I even packed because tomorrow we are heading to Kyoto. We got the train tickets right when we landed in Tokyo. I guess that's a little tip for anyone because ordering it online honestly was giving both of us a headache. Our train is at 10.30 a.m. but we should be fine. We're still a bit jet lagged. I don't know how that's possible if it's been like six days. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. As always, I will see you in the